I do will it be made clean. I do will it be made clean. May the peace and joy of Christ be with you today. Healings of Jesus is not just physical healing, but they are psychological and spiritual too. In today's Gospel, which is taken from St. Luke chapter 5, verses from 12 to 16, by healing a leper, Jesus clothes him with human dignity. Leprosy was one of the worst sicknesses that one could have at the time of Jesus because with leprosy one loses his or her social status, identity and human dignity. It is equal to non-existence. In the book of Leviticus chapter 13 there is a long prescription regarding leprosy and various kinds of skin diseases where a temple priest acts as a doctor who would examine and certify if a person is clean or unclean. In today's Gospel we see that the one whom a priest certified to be unclean is made clean by the Supreme High Priest and the Divine Doctor Jesus Christ. Respect for life and for human dignity compels Jesus to overlook certain measures from the book of Leviticus. And for the same reason, he instructs the one whom he healed to follow the second part of the prescription, that is, to go and show himself to a priest who would certify him to be clean, that he could be reinstated to his family and to the community that he can regain his social status, identity and human dignity which he had lost. My dear friend, when you feel rejected, isolated, unaccepted, humiliated, insulted or enslaved by certain sicknesses, do you feel worried? Do you feel, do you experience being stripped of human dignity? Do not be worried. Jesus who came to clothe yourself with human dignity says to you, Yes, I do will it. Be made clean. Two questions remain. Do you have the faith of the leper to say to Jesus, If you wish, you can make me clean. Secondly, do you strip off the human dignity of another? Pope Francis observes, human dignity is the same for everyone. If I tremble upon the human dignity of another, I tremble upon my own. May the touch of Jesus redeem us. Amen. <laughs>